Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to Ring to episode 10 of All Maidens in Your Savage Season. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. <laughs> You know, um, there's a lot of things I want to say about Nina right now that I can't actually say because I'm in my own fucking house and not at my aunt's house and trying to be quiet and everything. I honestly wanted to beat the shit out of her. I mean... There's always that one girl that, in the, like, okay, I I was always thinking this with Nina. I, I thought in the beginning, no, I was going to like her. She's not going to be the bitch of this show. Too late. She is the bitch of this show. I'm sorry. If you like her, that is fine. That is all up to you. Go ahead. Take it Take it for the team. I don't give a shit. But at the, same, at the end of the day, I don't fucking like her anymore. I'm sorry. After that shit, the shit that she trying to do, no. Sit your ass over there. I'm sorry. I am so sorry. Like, honestly, I had, this is all that energy I had from last Friday to this Friday, dealing with the BS over at my aunt's house and everything else during a fucking hurricane. Yes, dog. Well, it's supposed to be like <laughs> Man, but you can always get ones that are like half like animal print and then half silk, which are very nice. Those are the best ones. They're all pretty. Oh. oh, so they actually saw her getting in the car. Mm. Look what's see, look, look at the trash can. Really, we had to get to this part. <sighs> For when he tried to move his damn hand, what did Nina do? Nope, put it back. <sighs> Really?
Can I please beat her ass? Like, I mean, you know, nothing ain't gonna solve any problems she get her ass beat, but, you know, in my opinion, I think it could. Excuse me, don't don't think with the right head, the wrong head. Please, think with the right head. There you go, babe. No. I don't like that blood moon. Got a really bad feeling about this. But Hongo, how can you be so sure? What are you gonna do? Suck him off? <laughs> well, either that, stuck in a mop, but unfortunately, that's green. My God. <laughs>
Yeah, I mean, do you even have a razor and shaving cream? You got this, honey. Hmm? Well, he's not hard. <laughs> no, no, it's not even <laughs> Uncle. Oh, fuck you, you motherfucker. No, you must. Mm -hmm. There's got to be something else about her. Probably her past. See, I don't want to assume that she's possibly been, like, abused by a family member or a parent, but I don't know. That's why I really want an episode that goes into Mona's backstory, but I don't think we have time for that. Mina, you attractive, but you, you, you can't be with someone else's boyfriend. Oh, my God. Bitch. I kick her ass.
Okay, how the hell are you going to clean, cleanse that? And that's okay if you don't know what to say. Yeah. No, I feel sorry for her. Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> because I touched a girl's ass. <laughs> She's going to find out about that. Come on, man. <laughs> That's why you buy new panties. Oh my god. Oh, this is gonna be so awkward now. Can't be mad at him though. You know, fucking you. Know, shit. Hmm? 
No, you motherfucker! Why? You fucking kidding me, right? You you would end right there with four minutes left. She knows something's wrong. Bitch, she gonna find out next week. I don't want this to happen. Nope. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. No, no. I don't want her to find out, but at the same time, she needs to find out. And because Nina, you got a lot of explaining to do. Same thing with Izumi and this shit. And just the fact that she said to him, oh, you got hard. I'm like, God damn it. Oh, shit. Shit. That's all I'm thinking right now. I mean, it, and it's temptation. Nina is the temptation of this damn group. Girl, I mean, but at the same time, like, the fact that Momo, um, called her and they talked for a couple of seconds, well, minutes, and, like, Momo was saying, I think I'm in love with you. Now, it is, like, I, I still feel like somebody possibly abused Momo, but I felt like once Momo was grabbed by dude and she screamed and stuff, and how she was like, I need to be cleansed, been like, okay, so you... It, she she's the one out of the group who's trying to really find herself. If she is, if she likes guys, if she likes girls, if she likes both, that's truly her right now because she's in a predicament. Honestly. Hey, What? Shit. That's why it says bye bye. Mother fucker. Oh, fuck. Okay. Everything now, like, the dynamic between last week's episode and this week's episode has fucking changed. The consequences, their actions have consequences, especially with Izumi, you know, yes, touching her and then trying to put his hand away and then Nina bringing it back and then Nina telling him, oh, hey, you was hard and stuff, which is... She's, Kazusa's gonna find out, and when she finds out, this is gonna break her. She truly, after several episodes, finally these two getting together, fucking Nina comes in on her damn high horse. She being like fucking Ringo from Penguin Drum, ruining everything, because the fact is there, there's a difference between Nina and Ringo, obviously, but I don't really want to get into all that. But at the same time, you, you know, this girl, I, I can't with her. I still like her as a character. I still think she's fucking interesting. But to the fact that she's done this, it's just, I can't trust her anymore. I, I wouldn't, okay, if it was me and if I knew that someone who was close to me, one of my girlfriends ended up sleeping with one of my other friend's boyfriends, it's either one of two things. You're either going to be... <laughs> there are two types of girls. You're going to let your boyfriend still be around that chick, your best friend, or, you know, one of your friends. 
or you're not even going to have those two speak to each other anymore because you don't know how that person, male or female, is going to think. Because if they're the type who's just like, fuck it, I don't see... Um, I see sex as just sex and I'm just gonna fuck whoever the fuck I want to fuck instead of like mm, I'm gonna be known as this big like she like in the end I feel like Nina is known as this big ass slut I'm not saying that she is but because of the fact is I don't think Izumi is going to be like yeah I want to sleep with her but because of the fact is he called her and then after talking to Kazusa and he's like I'm in love with Kazusa so why am I doing this why do I have these feelings about Nina that's the biggest thing that is probably going to be talked about next week now well what's your face getting pregnant i'm not really surprised about that because i had a weird feeling about it coming up like with the last few weeks and it, it's a little fucked up that yes she's getting dropped out she's dropping out of school because of the fact is yes she is pregnant now as someone who went to high school and i did see because i never really saw it in middle school i did see more in high school around my junior and senior year i never really saw it in my um freshman and sophomore year i did see a lot of girls pregnant hell like even girls who i knew um my first year of high school by the time i was getting in my last two years and they were in maybe like one class with me as a freshman and then um later on bam they're pregnant and i'm like okay what the fuck happened but then you know we all know but it's just like some girls at that moment they have to either do one or two things you can possibly balance still having a child and going to both high school and college or you could probably just say i have to drop out because it's what's best for me and my child and honestly those are one of the hardest things that a teen mom has to think about that age she's now a teen mom because of how old she is like most of these girls and guys are like what 16 17 maybe 15 possibly um they're all still at a young age because they're all still in high school but you know you're dealing with an adult problem now with the fact that someone in their classroom is pregnant and it's just like fuck like wh what else do you say about that i mean yes there are gonna be people like oh hey well yeah she was a big ass slut or some people will be like oh well she she had it coming and some people are like that who have said well damn she kind of just fucked up her whole her whole life for wanting to possibly better herself and i have heard some people even said that say that about people who i knew and i was like no you can't say that about everyone because even though right here and now this person is pregnant and they still have their children or really their child by the time they graduate high school or they just decide to drop out they can still better their lives it's just going to be hard those first maybe couple of months or a couple of years because of the fact just if you ain't got a job sometimes your parents will not even take care of you and your baby sometimes that your parents will just kick you out i don't really know because like i said i haven't had a kid um and stuff, I would rather be successful first and then, while I am successful, have a child. But, you know, sometimes you you don't know what God or whatever religion that you are in. Because, you know, I'm a Christian and, da -da -da and stuff. But whatever, like, you believe in, you don't know what they have in store for you. It just happens. And you either keep it a secret and you don't tell your parents and they'll be pissed off at you or you tell them right then and there and they're not going to be as pissed as you as if you would have kept your mouth shut and waited several months later but like bruh i don't know this this shit i don't know what to think anymore but this shit <laughs> i can't but thank god hongo did not sleep with him and oh god that almost made me tear up like almost really but other than that guys that is my reaction to me towards episode 10 of oh maidens and your savage season if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like it really helps me out also subscribe to my channel i make videos every single day join the matcha squad and of course i will see you guys officially all next friday for episode 11 bye guys
Thank you.